Brilliant advice, man. Oh, fine, thank you, sir. You know, first, let's clear some of the questions that were asked okay. so that we proceed to other matters. The first question was that, you said when you hit 30 years, mm -hmm. it is your left hand that must be used to read your palm. So if there's anything you want to see about a person, you would use the left hand instead of the right. Somebody asked, what if the person doesn't have left hand? What if the hand has been amputated? Or people who were born without hands, do they also have a manual to their lives using the hand or the palm? Okay, um, Mr. Arnold, first I will greet yeah. your cherished viewers. Yeah. And uh, I will greet everybody who is watching us at mm. this moment. Mm to tell them that um, they are very lucky mm. to have you and also very lucky to, you know, to come across on this show. Yes. Because uh, first and foremost, mm. reading of the palm mm. <laughs> is beyond metaphysical. Right. Okay. Right. And it is beyond literal understanding. Mm. Okay. Mm. Because the palm itself has so many diversions and right. so many angles yeah which if you want to understand the palm that means you need to delve beyond the five senses of understanding of nature and delve more into spiritual i mean Realm. realms mm. okay so on your my questions. question those who don't yeah. have hands yes. at all yes yes Yes. Do they have a life? Do they do have a life? Mm. You see, it is not only the palm that we read. We, all, we also read the foot. You can read the foot yes. as well? Yes, we read oh. the foot. The foot also say a lot about Bye. you. Mm. Okay, but the palm is the basic one. Mm. Okay, mm. I can use your foot to heal you instantly. Mm. Yes, it is the palm which is very basically uh, yes. instrument that we need. Mm. And also... It is not only the lines. That's what I'm saying. There are people, they, they, they have this knowledge literally. Mm. Okay? Mm. And uh, because they are good in grammar, you know, in either English grammar or whatever, mm. they can buy the books and read the books. Mm. I hope you understand me. Yeah. So they will, be, they will be told that, you see, the first line, it meant this. The second, second line, line, it means that. that. The third line means that. That's all they know. So it is true and poor. Mm. Okay? But what I'm... What I'm sharing here is not about chewing and I'm pouring. Yeah. It's beyond that, okay? You should first ask yourself, why is the palm so effectively on you? Mm. Why is it that if you go to palmistry mm. and they, they read your palm, they sometimes tell you things which are accurate mm. in your life? Mm. It mean, does that mean the palm is determining who you are right. or who you are going to be? To be. You understand me? Mm. No. It's because there is a certain vibration. Mm. There's a certain faculty from the cosmos mm. that flows within your system. Mm. So if even you don't have the palm, you have aura. You have aura. You yes. understand me? You have aura. You have every, does everybody have aura? Everybody. Everybody has aura. Yes. Everybody has yes. aura. And celebrities only every, is loud. Everybody, everybody has aura. And yeah. your aura determines your life, mm. either in positive aspect or, or negative, negative aspect. aspect. Okay, so if you don't have palm, mm. you have aura. Mm. You know, let me tell you something. The mystics masters, mm. the hermetic masters, which mm. is, you know, what we you like do. this. Yeah. Okay, we've, we've compressed the aura, mm. understanding, into the lines. Mm. Okay, so there are people, they are not good at tapping of the auras. Mm. So they, when, they, when they, 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 they have the ideas and the knowledge mm. of the lines, mm. it's indirect in reading somebody's aura right okay but there are people they don't need that they don't need the lines they don't need the lines not at all okay they so, can just tap into your aura yeah so if you don't have palm mm. i can tap into your aura to know who you are mm. you see the, the the largest cosmos is the macrochism mm. and the smaller universe is the microcosm. Micro, yeah so this palm is micro mm. And the largest emptiness of the universe is, is the what macro. is the macro. So this micro, mm. the energy flows within the micro. Mm. Okay, it starts from somewhere. And then comes here. And comes here. So if you don't have this one, you can you go can, to yes, the other side. Yes. I hope you understand. I understand. Where it starts, mm. where it starts is the is the main door or main gate mm. of the you know uh, influence of the energies. Mm. So if the person happens to no, <laughs> someone who does not have the palm. Yeah. That doesn't mean we cannot read really cannot tap. Okay, so why is it necessary that when you hit 30, you use the left palm and not the right palm? 
Why is it so? You see, we have something called deific number. Mm. So this deific number is number seven. Mm. Okay, number seven, you can have two faculties, two dimensions in it, mm. which is the three and seven, which mm. is the third dimension, I mean the th three, three dimension, dimension. And, the the fourth, the yes, and the fourth dimension, mm. which is the astral plane. Mm. So when this combination comes together, it forms deific, it forms mm. divinity, which is perfection of what the creation of divine. Right. So we, when, when, when third, we, we normally read first seven seconds at your age, mm. we normally see your first seven uh, age, I mean, your first seven year On from Earth. your infancy or from your birth to, to your seven years. age seven, right. there is a certain thing that happened. Mm. There's a certain level of energy that mm. happened, you know, that flows within the system. Mm. The second seven, which is 14 years, 14 years. there is a certain I mean, also energy that flows within the system. Third seven, so 21. The, th the 21, mm. okay, is the third dimension. Mm. Okay, is mm. the third dimension. So the fourth dimension the fourth dimension is a 28 28 yeah do you understand me yeah so it means all the perfection of the celestial bodies mm. i mean the minerals mm. which is the elementary bodies the four mm. elementary bodies mm. are coming together. together so the 28 years they will not be set mm. accurate you know formed i mean fully formed, formed. in the feeder mm. until they get to 30 30 Okay. okay, so two years must do it, must add up. Must add up on the, for it to be full. For, for it to be full. Or fully formed. Yes, fully formed, consciously. 30. 30. Yeah. You know what I mean? So to we the hermetic, mm. okay, you know, we, we don't consider 18 years of age mm. as an adult. Okay. No, 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 no. We consider 30, from 28 to 30, 30 as, as an adult. adult. Right. You know I mean? Because that is when the four elementary bodies comes together. For, uh, seven times seven, mm. uh, seven, seven times, times four, four which is 28. Yes. So it will get fully set up in the system mm. at, the, at the age of 30. At the age of 30. So the age of 30, that means, the, uh, you know, the, the mm. consciousness mm. has matured to a certain level. Mm. You understand me? Yeah. So the consciousness that matured into a certain level, it gives more vibrant and energy to the left palm. To the left palm. Okay. Because the energy that flows within these two palms, mm. okay, if you are watching me, mm. The left palm is there to do what? To receive. Mm. And the right palm is there to do what? To send energy. Right. So which is why if somebody wants to pray for you, he has to use his left, uh, right palm mm. and place it on top of you, then he begins to pray. Mm. Because he is sending energy into to your body. You. Yeah. Okay. So if you want to cast away demons in mm. somebody's body, you need to use the left palm. If, if you want to cast away demons yes, from somebody's yes. body, use the left, left palm. palm. If because you want you to are, bless, yes, right use palm. the right palm. Because the left palm always do what? Always receive. Mm. So the energies that flows within your head region, mm. okay, it is the left hand receives before the, 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 right. the right. But when you are below 20, I mean 28, mm. when it receives, it gives to the right palm mm. more. More. You understand me? Because okay. it vacuum it's not matured enough to do what to to, to handle okay. the energy okay. so it gives to the, right, to the hand. right hand so at that time before you hit 30 the right hand is more vibrant in terms of energy yes in terms of energy so you can use that to read yes yes but when you hit 30 the left hand is yes. strong enough to maintain yes. the energy yes okay. and also many a time the left the right hand mm. is not in the position of prediction you know predicting one's future life okay Okay, the left hand, we can use the right hand to tell you your past life. Okay. Uh, your past life. Your past life. Yes. Can be read from your right yes. hand. Yes. So if you if you exceed 30 years, you know, if you're above 30 or you are, you know, in 30s, mm -hmm. we can still use your right palm to predict your, your past, past life. life. But okay. the left... So the left hand talks about your future and the present lives. Okay. You understand? Uh, your yeah, future and your present lives. Present and future. future yes. Left hand, past life, right hand. Yes. Okay, so if somebody comes and then you need to diagnose something about the person, is it sometimes very important that you first know the person's past life in order to predict what the future could be? Or this has nothing to do with prediction. It is accuracy. Whatever it is, it is the palm that will tell what the future is going to look like. You see, when you understand the energies that mm. flows in the palm, mm. it means you are not a predictor. Yeah. Okay, you are not going to predict. Prediction simply means probability. Probability, yes. Okay, yes. but if you understand the vibrations mm. 
the cosmic energies flows in the palm. You don't predict. You don't predict. Okay. You you only speak hmm. per the experiences and how you understand the energies. Hmm. So it is hundred percent accurate. Hundred percent accurate. Not ninety-nine. No room for no, no margin of no error. 99. No ninety-nine. No ninety-nine. Yes, but if you are a chew and pour. Mm. If what your what you what you know about the palm is only chewing Chewing and and pouring, read it on the internet, then it will never be accurate. Mm. But if you understand the energies, like me, Mm. I can use your left palm only Mm. to to tell you about your past Mm. without seeing the right palm. Without seeing the right palm. Because the energy flows within the left because it goes to the right. Mm. So I tap the energy directly. So I can use only the right, I mean the left palm to tell you your past, present and your future. So if this information is very accurate and it's 100% most of the times or all of the times. Why isn't everybody studying palmistry, becoming a master of it to make our lives simple? Like me, why am I not a, a palm reader to just know about my life? Because you know your life, you know your future. Uh-huh. You, you're looking at your palm, you know your future. Uh-huh. So why can't you just teach people so that we all know our future? I have, I have online classes that I teach people. Mm. You see, Africa, we, we have leaning understanding about spirituality. Mm. Okay, we normally perceive spirituality as, 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 as evil, you know, uh, you know, perspective of mm. knowing. We normally consider things always God, God, mm. God, God. Yeah. Meanwhile, we, we forgot to apprehend the, the, you know, the mechanisms of God, mm. which is the palmistry, astrology, mm. and so on and so forth. Mm. These are you know, mechanisms that will lead you to understand who God is or mm. what God is. Mm. Do you understand me? Mm. You cannot delve into God without knowing the fundamental I mean, elements uh, element of God. Mm. You can't. Mm. So you need to know what God is through his nature, mm. through, through his creation, through his energies before you can perceive God. Before you can perceive God. Yes. So it is our own mindset and thinking that's preventing us from knowing. Yeah, we do. There is a say if you ha- if you want to hide something from the black man, put it's it in, the, in book. the book. Because we do we normally don't want to read. We normally don't want to listen. Mm. We can listen to the brain with the brain without the heart. Mm. We normally listen with the brain and the heart without the intellect. Mm. These are some of the reasons why Africa still you know grow into doom all the time mm. because. As I'm, as I'm talking to you right mm. now, mm. there will be somebody who will just come to the comment section oh, blah, 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 oh, yeah. and say something. <laughs> Meanwhile, <laughs> if you ask him to explain what I'm doing, he can't. He can't. Oh, he happens. Okay. They Meanwhile, to some, of them will, yes, some of them will only, only go to the internet and just and read what they just saw there and just come blah, 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 and write something. Yeah. You understand me? Meanwhile, it goes beyond that. Yeah, it goes, it goes beyond, beyond that, chewing yeah. and pouring. Yeah. It goes beyond that. Way beyond it. Way beyond that. Okay, because the line alone. Mm. Okay, you can use only the line and do some predictions. Mm. Okay, but to delve more into details, you should first ask yourself, why is this line has an influence on human beings? Mm. Does this line has a connection with a divine source? Mm. If yes, then the palm is not a physical thing. It is not ordinary. No, it's beyond that. It's beyond... You going to chew and pour it. Okay, let, let me ask this question before we now we'll be touching on palmistry and love, compatibility. You and your girlfriend, you and your wife, looking at your palms, would you be compatible if you should continue to get married? So I can bring my girlfriend to see Doc and say, Doc, look at my palm, look at her palm. Can we get married? Eddie, bring your girlfriend, you know. Let's doc read. Doc, no, Eddie, you can't marry this lady because what your palm is saying is different from what her palm is saying. So we'll be touching on that. But final question before we move to that. Very elderly people or very prominent people, it is very difficult for them to actually greet you with their palm. Yeah. You know, they will either wave or give you a hand gesture. It is very difficult for them to get hold of you with That's true. Some avoid that because of spiritual attacks. Hmm. Others, maybe because of a quantre or something, hmm. uh, uh, you know, a man of God has told them. Hmm. What is it about, again, the palm that makes it difficult for people to use it to just greet anybody when they get to a certain stage in life? You know, uh, to be honest with you hmm. guys, you see, in a normal circumstance or in a normal note, uh, it is not good for you to be greeting, to be shaking hand with people. Mm. If you are not spiritual, you are not more 
and if you're not very powerful, powerful and yes, spiritual, spiritual it's not it's advisable not, to not shake advisable hands with people because some people their aura mm. you know their palm aura mm. always attract negativity so mm. they are full of negative in their in palm. their palm yes so uh, as soon as you greet them you will also be affected by that you tap into it you tap definitely for sure Mm. Okay, for sure, because it, it is it is an energy. Mm. Okay, so definitely, if you shake hand with them, definitely you are going to attract that in your system. Mm. So, which is why normally to avoid all this, the elderly men, I mean the higher spiritual people, they normally don't want to shake hand with people, mm. and the prominent, you know, people as we know, mm. they normally don't want to you know shake hand with people because shaking hand with people might cause you, it might cause you problems, mm. might cause you negative energies. And also diminish mm. your success in mm. life. Mm. You understand me? So it is not good, but it is not order, good, not at all. Yeah. But in other hand, to mm. you know, as we are living in religious, you know, country. Yeah. You cannot go away with that. With that. So yeah. what you need is to be more spiritual to activate your aura mm. more powerful. It's like when your immune system is more vibrant, mm. when your immune system is more strong. It's Each and every virus yeah. that comes in the system, it fights it if, out. Yes, it fights it. Yes. So when your energy is more higher, mm. okay, each and any or each and every negative energy that comes to you, it your energy will it. repel it. Yeah, it will repel it back. Mm. So you need to activate it more higher mm. and more vibrant. This all the time. this this message should definitely go to my fellow very popular guys out there. We greet a lot, you know. Mm. Well, because I hardly mm. go out, mine is a bit minimal. <laughs> but also, we challenge somebody, a fan sees you, he wants to greet you by force. If you don't do it, pay trouble. Mm. So you end up using your palm a lot. Yes, yes, yes. Doc is saying, build yourself spiritually so that as you greet people, you will be safe. Your energy can repel all the negative energies mm. that come. Now, let's come down to the subject matter proper. Eddie has a girlfriend. Brown has a girlfriend. I mean, he just met a new lady. They want to see if the future will be bright for them. Should Eddie bring this lady to you and say, Oh, Doc, I've met this girl on Legon campus. I think I love her. Doc, read and see if our love will be good or I should just dog her. Doc, okay. is it very important? Yeah, it is very important. You see, uh, let's begin with the lines before mm. I will talk about the energy. Right. Or let's begin with the energy first. You see, we have in, in the palm, mm. palmistry, mm. okay, we have these four elementary energies, right? Okay, which is the earth, water, and air, and what? Earth, and the fire. water, yes. Earth, water, air, and fire. And fire. Yes. Okay. So if your palm mm. happens to be an air sign, okay, mm. palm. Yes. If it has, it if the, your palm, you know, always, uh, you know, receive more firing energy mm. into it, it is not good for you to go for a lady. Who her palm normally receive water and energy? It's Me, I'm good. water. Uh -huh. Yes, I checked. Eddie, Eddie you are you what? Checked. Eddie is also water. You see, yes. we are talking about the palm. The palm, not yeah. Not your zodiac aspect or your planetary. Oh, so that one too is different. It's different. The zodiac okay. or planetary your, is different. Yes, your, your, your palm, your palm, your palm mm. energy could be different from your planetary energy. So could it be that your palm could be air, your uh, planetary your will be water? Be fire. Oh, oh yes okay yes, well well understood is. okay yes. so now let's base on yours yes if you are fire mm -hmm. it will not be advisable for you to date a lady whose mm -hmm. palm you is see, water you see your palm yes see the palm this is my left it's, it's long yes and uh, the, the fingers yes are also long yes okay so mm -hmm. that tells you your palm is air sign yes air sign okay you understand me? yes which is why the other day i told you mm. you, you you normally want fresh air yes okay you, don't, you, you normally don't want a place where whereby it's, hot. it's hot and mm. more echo no last like night it. i was on top of the building <laughs> you understand me? because your palm is long yeah and the fingers are so the long. fingers too are long yeah okay you could see some people too their palm is long and the fingers are, are short. short yeah you understand me? Mm. That's the uh, earth signs. Earth sign. Okay. okay. And some people too, their fingers are long, long the and the palm is short. short. Oh. You understand me? Okay. So all these things, it tells you how or uh, the energies which the palm receives. receives. So if your palm receives negative, I mean, uh, firing energy, mm. then you shouldn't go for watering 
who, who has, has watering, watering energy. energy. Okay, so if you go for a lady who has watering energy, what will happen to you both? Fine. Mm. You see, in this realm of uh, spirituality, or let's mm. put it in this realm of, you know, knowing. Mm. In the beginning, I'm using beginning because uh, we don't have a great language, proper language to explain spirituality. Right. Spirituality normally delves into numeral understanding. Mm. I mean, numeral, you know, things. And um, it was the eye, which is the oneness, and mm. okay, and it was divided into dua. Mm. So we have this dua sign, which is the positive and the and negative. negative yeah. So all these things, uh, it has an influence. Mm. It's like electricity. If you have positive and you don't have the negative one, it won't work. It won't work. Yeah. Okay. So you being the firing uh, uh, energy mm. person, mm. you your your palm receive more fire energy. Yeah. If you go for a lady who has a watering energy in her palm, mm. it is not compatibility. It you is are not, not compatible. No, no, no. You are not compatible. You are not compatible. No, you are not compatible at all. Mm. You are not compatible because the the lady. Mm. She's, uh, she's, she's fixed, that mm. is one, and she's also cool, that is two, mm. and she's not prone to action, right. that's three. Yeah. Okay, and you as a firing pump uh, you know, guy, yeah. guy you, you are energetic, you are vibrant, you are, yes, you, are, you can be vulnerable at the same mm. time. Mm. Okay, so this will be bringing chaos in your marriage, mm. okay, all the time, the lady, the lady will be facing problem, mm. and all the time, you, the guy, too, both of you will be feeling incomplete. Incomplete, yeah. Okay, you will yeah. feel incomplete. You are together, but you feel incomplete. incomplete. Mm. Because the energies are not compatible. Mm. We are talking about energies here. Yeah. The energies are not compatible. They are not compatible. Not at all. So you have marriages that doesn't have happiness, yes. but they are together. Yes, yes. But there's no happiness. There's no happiness and because the, the energies are not compatible. compatible. So if you are fire, you should go for air sign. If you are fire, you should go for, for air, air sign. sign. Air, air and Yes. And if you are water sign, you should go for what? Earth sign. Okay, now let's let's look at this. If I'm water sign mm -hmm. and I go for if and, and then she's and let's say I'm fire and she's water, mm -hmm. the water will quench my fire. Somebody will tell you that that is compatibility. Yes, because, because the water will quench, will quench your, fire. your fire. No, no, no. Don't use ideas. We don't use ideology <laughs> to that's how many people I used to watch them. Okay, I used to watch them, they always say that it is it is <laughs> Don't use your colo colo ideas. No. <laughs> you can't this, answer this, somewhere. this is law. <laughs> this is law. This is law. Don't you use your colo don't like. use your mind, your brain. <laughs> okay, don't. This is law. It is law. Okay. If you are fire, nege nege po po yeah. Okay, this is law. Mm. So if you are a firing Person. elementary body, <laughs> yeah, don't go for a lady who is water. Wow. Thinking that since you are a fire, she will quench you. When Whenever you get she'll angry, she will quench you. No, 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 no. Let me tell you something. On the other hand, too, yeah. you, should, you didn't think about, about what I'm going to say. Right. Okay, you thinking since you are a fire, she will quench you. Water, yeah. Okay, what if when fire, when you put water, mm. okay, in, on, on top of fire, what, yeah. does it ha what does it happen? It boils. It boils, yes. And yes. it gets more. Yes, yes, yes. And it when you put water energy. on top of fire, fire. it, it boils. Oh, and yes. you get more energy. more energy yes and vapor yes that's where you die she would end you end up dying she will kill you she will kill you because at the first sight you are burning she, already. yes you are burning on her at first sight, she will be she will, she will try to control but mm. it will get better she can't she, can, she can't take yeah. it anymore yes because the energy will keep rising it's rising bit by bit to 100 degrees and over. when it gets to 100 degrees my man you run mm. so don't use your colomenta don't use your mind and say that since you are a fire, she is water, water. She, will cook, she will quench your this thing. No, this is a law. <laughs> let tell them, oh, tell them. This is law. Let them know. Listen to me, black man, I want you to understand something. <laughs> we have three mechanisms mm. that put up this universe. Yeah. I mean, basically, mm. okay? You have neutrons, protons, and what? And atoms. Yeah. Okay, I want you to know this. In you, as a black man, mm. okay, you have something called melanin, mm, melanin. okay, <laughs> which made you to be a black man, mm. made you more vibrant. Mm. In you, the black man, mm. we have these six things. You have six neutrons, mm. six protons, and six atoms mm. in your mechanism. Mm. Okay, so normally, don't be dumb. 
You should know that you are more you are more vibrant person as a black man. You are vibrant. Yes, you are spiritual mm. because you are a combination of these three things. And six of each. Yes, six of each. Six protons, six atoms, and six uh, uh, neutrons. So you are uh, you have this three dimension mm. of energies. So let your brain wax. Let the mind, the faculty of your mind, wax. Your intellect. Yes. Do not say, because I'm fire, she's water, she's going to quench it. Hey, my man. Forget don't it. Don't go that. So, if you are fire, who should you go for? Air sign. Air sign. Look at it. Look at it this way. Okay. And air and fire comes together. Mm. It brings harmony. Mm. Okay. Mm. Maybe if there's a fire in here. Mm. <laughs> and um, at the same time, Air the is, wind blowing. is blowing. The wind is blowing. Mm. What do you think it will happen? The fire get more energy. Yeah. At the same time, the air also get more energy. Mm. So, so they, they grow together. They grow together. And they groom together. No, there's no quenching here. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. We are no. quenching. People. You see, what is Note. love? <laughs> you can ask each and every psychology mm. to 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 define what love. love is. A pure love is for two people. Mm. facing one direction to achieve one thing. Mm. Mm. Love is different from what? From passion. From passion. We are talking about love here, not love. passion. Yes, we are talking about love. love. It has to grow. Flame. It has to grow. You both have to get a certain, uh, you know, a certain thing, uh, a certain achievement mm. that you need to achieve in life. Okay, so when the air sign and the firing sign comes together, mm they get into each other because they are all their particles are all fable mm. okay mm. air sign is fable air is fable and mm. fire is fable mm. so they get into each other okay they get along into each other mm. okay air represents what the soul mm. and the fire represents the spirits mm. so they get together they get and along to each other it goes on well and the um, water is the intellect is the mental aspect of you mm. Okay, that mm. is water. Mm. Okay, and the 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 earth, uh, the earth sign mm. is the physical aspect of you, which is this body. Right. Okay, and you see, this is liquid, and this is solid. Solid. They get along with each other. Okay, so if you are this pure water, science. if you are water sign, vibe with earth sign lady. Yes. Or if the lady is water lady, vibe with earth sign man. Yes. This is pure science. This is pure science. Solid. Don't liquid. use your brain here. Yeah. This is pure science. This mm. pure science, mm. these are elementary bodies, mm. okay, that goes to each other. Fire and earth, they go together. Earth and, earth water, and water goes together. Go together. So if you crisscross any of this, it is wrong it is pairing. wrong. So if you have earth and fire, wrong. Yes. If you have water and, uh, and, uh, and what? Water and uh, air is and wrong. Air, wrong. Wrong. Earth and water, water. Solid. solid. Air and fire, solid. solid. So we are com we are forming compatibility for you, yes. the loved ones out there. So call Doc and ask him, or bring your girlfriend, <laughs> bring, bring your wife. If you, no, we could be laughing here, but it's a serious matter. Mm -hmm. You and your wife are going through several miscommunication, no confusion. Let me just put it that way: confusion every single day. For you know, you are water and she is fire. Mm -hmm. You are not compatible. Yes, but nobody not. is telling you this. Mm -hmm. They are relating it to other things. See doc for doc to break it down reading your palm. Yes. And also mm. you see our blood mm. cells. Mm. They also have compatibility. Yes, yes, yes. They also have compatibility. Yes. And that one whether you like it or not, you have to respect you it. You have to respect it. Mm. The same apply to this uh, faculty. You mm. need to respect it. Yeah. It okay. Is science. It is mm. si it, look, whatever I'm teaching you here, mm. let me tell you something. <laughs> Any spirituality that differs with science, mm. eh? It's a lie. It's mm. a cake. It's a cake. I'm telling you. Mm. Any spirituality mm. huh, that differs with science or any religion that differs with science, it's a I'm cake. telling you it's a cake. That religion has mm. a two million questions mm. to be asked. I'm telling you. Mm. My religion mm. is a religion of science of the soul. Mm. And the stars and they never go wrong never that's my unless opinion. the practitioner